everybody, welcome to YouTube Basil Ray version 2.0. It's time for some renewed efforts over here to make sure we're getting all the good stuff to you wonderful people. So today we're going to take a look at something I don't believe anyone has really sat down and formally put together a, a video review for. I could certainly be wrong. I've been wrong once or twice today. Uh, but this is the uh, OCD tank. Sorry, I nearly called it the IB tank because that's where you purchase it. IB as in boy tanked.com. Uh, occasionally, you'll find people use those names interchangeably. Uh, but OCD from over in Vapors Forum is the proprietor over at ibtanked.com and he's put together a really fantastic tank here. When you go to order this, there's two things you need to get. You need to purchase a set of these stainless steel end caps and you need to purchase a tank body. The first thing I said when I saw these is that stainless steel end caps were probably going to be way too heavy and it wasn't something I was interested in. Um, during uh, my thanks, uh, sorry, tanks for the memories video discussion over on Vapors Forum, um, I got a little bit of a ball busting for not having looked at this tank or, or having one. So OCD actually offered to send me one and I said, you know what, I really appreciate that but the price point is so low on these, I'm gonna go out and buy one. Um, for this setup, I paid $19 for the end caps, which is the going rate, and I paid, I think it was $10 for this crimson red tube, so it'll match the LEDs on my ProBerry. They've got a lot of different tank options. Tanks are made out of borosilicate, um, which is generally uh, referred to as Pyrex, even though that's more of a commercial trademarked name. Um, so they are made of glass, and they are quite thick. They're a couple millimeters thick, um, very solid, very durable. I've dropped mine a ton of times and I haven't had any problems, but obviously they are glass, so keep that in mind um, as you're handling them. So $19 for the end cap, $10 for this particular uh, tank body. They have a smorgasbord of other offerings. They've got holiday tanks, they've got marble tanks, they've got clear tanks. The clear are your best value. So if you, I would have gotten the clear tank, uh, that glass piece cut would have been $5. $19 for the end caps, that's $24 before shipping, which is really reasonable, I think it's $3, something like that. So for under $30, you get one of the nicest tanks out there. It's a Pyrex tube, you never need to worry about the juice you're putting in, and you have stainless steel end caps. For one more dollar, you can get a spare set of O-rings and you're on your way. So to put this together, um, simply pop one end cap in, Pop the other end cap in. Then you're gonna need an XL length cardo. That is what these tank, these will not, repeat, will not fit uh, your single coil, your standard length cardos, or your dual coil standard length. They do need to be the XLs. So you can use a uh, single coil or dual coil in this tank. Um, I've got just a real cheapo drip tip on here, and that's what I'm gonna use to assemble this. So I'm gonna kind of uh, slide this in. Notice how I pulled this down. That allows me to come in here and fill up the tank with liquid. And we're pretty much full. So now I can carefully slide the cardamizer through here, making sure I line it up. Once I've lined it up, I can simply push it through and I am set at this point. I can change drip tips or I can continue to use this one. Uh, I don't really like this drip tip, so I am going to change it, but it's that easy. To fill it again, um, you'd probably want to put on a drip tip like this, slide it back down, fill it up, slide it back on. Of course, if I had one of those uh, fancy uh, slap your sister-in-laws or whatever they're called, I could have used that. But for the price point here, you're getting a Pyrex tank, stainless steel end caps, phenomenal value. Let's go up and just make sure that it vapes correctly. I'm gonna go ahead and uh, pull this drip tip off and then we're gonna get into it. So here is the OCD tank on my Proveri. Uh, as you can see here, it matches up with the, you know, the LED light pretty nicely. So I got exactly what I want. Now this is a single coil Bose cardamizer. It is the XL length. Because remember, you have to use the XL length in this tank. And I'm pushing it at 4.6 volts right now. I can see it feed. The tank is semi-transparent, so I can see my liquid level. And I can see the air bubbles come out of the cardamizer, letting me know that juice has now entered the filler. So this is a, a cardamizer that I punched myself using uh, the $15 Siam Mods Cardo Punch. Um, I've got some other Cardo Punch stuff that I use. 
uh, one of these Mark's uh, kind of cheap DIY cardo punch. If you search that on some of the forums, you'll find it. Just a drill press piece and the right screw. So I punch my own cardomizers. Use this tank. Um, this is the only tank I've been using for the last couple of weeks now, and I really like it. Super durable, looks nice, and you literally cannot beat the price point. Um, for a tank that is made out of Pyrex or borosilicate, uh, the more proper name, right? It was stainless steel end caps. There is no refuting. This is the best bang for your buck currently available in terms of cardamizer tanks. This has become my new favorite tank, no lies. Uh, I got my balls busted pretty hard by the crowd over at Vapors Forum for not looking at this in my Tanks for the Memories video. Like I said, OCD offered to send me one and I said, at that price, I'll go out and buy one. So I bought one and I haven't looked back since. I'll probably buy another one or maybe even another tube, maybe uh, something fancy to go on my black silver bullet, you never know. But I do absolutely love this tank. There's not much to say about it. It's a tank. It does exactly what it says it's supposed to do. And it's a superior value compared to some of the competitors. It's less expensive than the clean tank by about 100% less expensive. It's less expensive and much easier to get than the lava tank. It's not that much more expensive than some of the other cheap tank options out there, like the cheap smoke tech tanks, but you know it's going to last. And if, if... You crack this glass, it's easy to replace. Uh, you go out to IB Tanked, you can order a different colored one. Or if you want to be cheap about it, order a clear one. They're $5. Order a couple extra ones, order some extra O-rings. I highly suggest you head on over to IBTanked.com. Pick yourself up one of these tanks, some XL cardamizers, single or dual coil, your choice, and you're going to be rocking some vapor. So there you have it. As always, you can catch me around the forums between ECF and Vapors Forum. That's where I spend most of my time. Got to give a shout out to New Vapor. You can find all my videos in my own little sub forum there on newvapor.com. And of course, the basal phone. 612-293-6405. Love to hear from you. Please, until next time, by all means, take care.